everyone, Comic Reviewer here, and this time reviewing on Disney's The First Kid. Now, as you know, The First Kid was a 1996 um, slapstick comedy film, and what's interesting is that Sinbad is meant, it plays the character Sam Sims, who is a Secret Service agent, and who is pretty much, much assigned by his superior, Wolks, Wolks, played by Robert Gilbami, also known for playing Rafiki in The Lion King. So pretty much he's assisted in protecting the president's son, Luke Davenport. Now, Luke's character is this rebellious, mostly teenager who wants more than being the first kid. And pretty much after his actions and behaviour causes another agent called Woods, played by Timothy Busfield, also known for playing Elliot Nasher in Terminal Era. So with Woods' actions, I'm not blaming him for being annoyed with Luke's behaviour, and I'm not blaming him for being a bit annoyed with Luke's mother. So pretty much throughout the movie, you have Sims trying to be there for Luke, and most of his actions do kind of get Sims put in trouble, but later on, you do kind of see them slowly bond, and kind of taking this, like, like surrogate uncle and son relationship. So pretty much at the same time, yeah, Luke also has to deal with the bully Rob, and it's clear that Rob is actually jealous of him, and probably feels that he deserves what he has. And I feel like the love interest, Katie, is just thrown in there with no real reasons. So pretty much throughout the film is mostly just Sims trying to help Luke out, helping him, you know, be who he is. And what's interesting is that they do a great job in pointing out internet safety, and it sort of becomes kind of the main plot for the film. So I think there were ways that I think the film could have been a little better. I feel like with Sim's friend Jash, you could have had them both signed to Luke after Luke, with Sim's being the more responsible one, and basically Sim's being the more reckless one. And I feel like, yeah, you could have had Wilkes as Sim's uncle, who was who was basically friends with Sims' dad, who could have been who could have been assassinated after protecting the previous president, and even like having him expect Sims to carry on the legacy. And I kind of expect you could have had Morton, who could have been a rival and friend of Sims' dad, and could have expected him to carry on the legacy. So what's actually interesting is that yeah you could have also had Woods being assigned to a different job and could have expected to get his job back without the kind of over-the-top means. So what's actually interesting in the shopping mall you do see Luke playing a virtual boy when the thing was still around and what's actually interesting former presidents like such as Sonny Bonjo as well as Bill Clinton had cameo appearances, with Clinton talking to Luke's father on the phone, as well as Sonny Bondo heading into the president's office before Sims meets him. It's interesting they got these presidents to kind of come in, do the film, and yeah. So what's actually interesting is that, yeah, you do see Sinbad in other stuff, What's interesting, they do foreshadow Jingle all the way, and eventually you do see Sinbad playing in Steven Universe as Mr. Smiley, who looks almost like him. So I think the movie isn't bad. I think there was still a bit of improvements, but I think somewhere, First Kid dodged the bullet, took the hit, with a small cult following. So I think it deserves a thumbs up. Still good, and still alright. So, Comic Reviewer here, signing out.